Hey. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi. I've been trying to get a hold of you. Are you okay? Yeah, of course. What do you mean? Oh, you know the news? There's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you going to start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Uh, you know, you don't have to do that. That's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. Satellite saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Angus crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. Still do a lot of traffic. Get me away from the computer. I'm telling Nathan, it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options here at a hot dog right now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on. I'll have to do that in a chat room, talking to some guy. They're 37. <laughs> yeah, that. Hmm. Not much to see here. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest four by. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Okay, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on right now. It's gonna be. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. I'm getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. 
Nathan, the rocks. I got it. I got it. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. Now that we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use... Whoa, oh, see? Shit. Take this slow. Yeah. So Nathan, you're thinking Avery, Two, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Let's go check out that tower. <clears throat> Shape is something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. <clears throat> Sam, look. Captain of the Fiery Dragon operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. Maybe Avery recruits pirate. Stupid wet bees. That don't make any sense. stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. Hey, did you know our car came with a winch? No, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. How to do it? Well, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We clear the hill. Well, not yet. Small victory. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. <laughs> Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine. You've come here. A well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> Those poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here.
taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is... I'll be right back. Uh, okay, so uh, you're not interested. I am. Just checking something out. Would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. How's it? You have that dungus hooked up yet? We're all set up. Just waiting on approval from Nadine to blow it. Good. Place looks empty. I'd like to get it over with and move on. Just put me in charge. Done in half the time. Considering the last time you handled explosives, you nearly blew up everyone in the street. I'd say it's a good thing you're not in charge. I'll be sure to run that by Nadine. Yeah. <laughs> 
Brake boys show their pretty faces. You all. Okay, I think that's it. Damn it, Rafe and Nadine must stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. By explosions. Rafe can't tell you about that. I don't think Rafe has much of a say. Look, another sigil. Huh. Adam Baldridge. He ran King's Bay for a while. He was a traitor, slaver, general scoundrel. Look at you. Yeah. Prison, a lot of books. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now how do we get out of here?
One down, one to go. Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. All right, hang on, guys. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she... Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Just thinking the same damn thing. But they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah you're right. Uh, hey, is that a well? Sully, you stole your joke. What have we here? Did you find some? Maybe. Do me a favor, get behind the wheel for a sec. <clears throat> hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. Okay, what do we have here? So? Nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. Sully, what were you talking about? Uh, yeah. So, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery, you know. Uh, ah, no. See that smoke? Oh, shoreline, slow down. Sam, what were you talking about? Uh, oh, right. Um, 
shoreline, idiots. We should just blow it up ourselves. <laughs> Think we're clear. Hey, look. Anything in the pit? Oh, check it out. Maybe this. Sam, what were you talking about? Uh, oh, right. <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Check this out. What if that's man-made or natural? Looks to me to be half and half. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? Cool. Holy shit, you can probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city.
Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? I can't tell. <laughs> Look at this. Quite the view. <sighs> Just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solid. Sam. Oh, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go... Check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge. How medieval. Yeah. Keep alive. Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. And Bonnie. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. <laughs> right. Nathan, come check this out. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. Be careful, kid. Hey guys, 
There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Special delivery! Ah! Whoa, 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 whoa! Yeah. You got this? Mm -hmm. I see with you. I'll bring the car closer. Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. Get that bridge down.
try that again. There we go. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? <laughs> uh, we ain't got no auto club out here, Nathan. It's not the nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Gonna take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh <laughs> two hundred thousand. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I'm not exactly expecting to be part of it. All set. Here we go. Let's not get stuck here. Uh oh. oh. You're overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Hold on to something. Ah. ah, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, almost. Now, let's find our way in. Get in that way. <laughs> Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Heads up! Yes. 
Sen, heads up. Let's see what we got here. He's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... Um... That's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys. <laughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here.
bottom? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Ma'am? Here. Hey, what are you doing? He's confirming a suspicion. Oh. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. That's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Guess we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. <laughs>